What's happening folks? I'm back. Got another video for you guys. And this one is going to be about how to improve the gaming performance on your Samsung Galaxy S3. This is going to work for all the North American variants. And uh, may I say, you know, good morning to everyone. It's like, I don't know, oh, there you go, 10 a.m. I was up at like 9. Well, actually, I was up earlier than that. But anyways, point is, first thing I'm going to show you guys is what's under the hood of this. Alright, so as you can see, completely stock. So let's back out here. Second thing I'm going to show you, it's rooted. So that's what you need. You have to have the phone rooted to do what you're about to do next. So, once you're there, go to the Play Store. And go for Trickster Mod. So shout out to Team Trickster here. So, I mean, I already have it installed. This is just, you know... To walk you guys through it once I'll let you guys go read through here on your own time but once you have it installed just open it so here you go this is doing its thing all right so when it starts off it's gonna be on the info page so as you can see this is the Canadian edition and it'll show off the uh, device monitoring area right there sorry I just had a hiccup Alright, let's move over. So this is the CPU control thing. And as you can see though, that minimum on the monitoring was 384, so it's 1026 here. This thing doesn't like to reflect all the time the real frequency for the minimum. I don't know why it does that, but as long as you know it's running at minimum. Like once you have once you click the check mark at 384, it'll say like that. Don't worry about this. Now this is where it gets interesting. So this is where I've never seen this in an app before. GPU governor, right? So you've seen uh, CPU governors, not for GPU though. So by default, it's set to on demand. You want to set it to performance. So what this will mean is the GPU is going to work 100%, 100% of the time, which will, you know, at one hand, you know, it'll improve the GPU, of course, but on the other hand, battery life will be at the cost of this. So that's that. Also turn this off. I don't find it useful. MP decision. So now that you've downloaded that app, the next thing you're gonna to want to do is test it out. So let's say what better game would be to use it on than Nova 3? Just because everyone knows it lags like crazy on the North American S3 because Gameloft doesn't know how to optimize their games all that well. No offense to you, Game Loft. Shout out to you guys. The only thing about I have to say about you guys is, you know, you provide good games, but at the same time, you're, it's like a 50-50 hit or, hit or miss with you guys in terms of optimi proper optimization. So, anyways. So, let's just uh, reset this for you guys. Alright. So campaign. Let's start it up. Let's see what happens. So, I'll just put it down for the duration of this. Alright, should be good any second now. There we go. Alright, so I'm gonna let it play through the cinematics because you know, dramatic effect and all. All right, guys. Let's get this going. So as you can see so far, it's completely smooth right now, for the most part. <laughs>
core ship. All right. Now, when the not lag usually kicks in, is right in this fight right here. This is when it becomes very noticeable. All right. So. Sorry, it's hard to play through uh, a recording device here, but uh, I think so far so good. Uh oh. Gotta hide, gotta hide, gotta hide. Where is a good place to hide? Where's a good place to hide? Okay, there we go. Okay. <laughs> okay. But as so far as you can see here, it is. You know what? I'm gonna need these bastards too. <laughs> As you can see though, it is pretty smooth at this point. This is not something you would have gotten otherwise, so... Um, hey, you die. Alright. Oh, oops. Sorry, again. I'm trying to w w figure, you know, watching between the recording device and just looking around the corner because it's easier to do this. Anyways, so there you go guys. That is pretty much it. So you can you saw there, it actually becomes very playable at that point. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Subscribe, guys. The last thing I'm gonna mention for this is you may have to mess. Actually, I probably should have mentioned this earlier, but in terms of the CPU and the uh, governor and I/O stuff. So actually, that's on this page. What did I click? No, I don't want that. You off? Okay. So, on demand, I'd leave it at that for CPU governor. In terms of the scheduler, by default it's set to CFQ. I recommend deadline because it'll, it just works better than anything else. It's deadline or noop. Those are the IOs you want to use. And yeah, so that's actually it now. So again, I'll reiterate, subscribe. I hope you guys enjoy the video. And have yourselves a wonderful day. And yeah, peace.